this one's called, we're going to have a party. We're going to have a party, inviting all our friends. We'll have some crisps and frizzy drinks. It starts when daytime ends. So pack your bags, your toothbrushes, little gloves to warm your hands. It's party time for mum and dad. You're off to stay with Gran. We clean the toilet, wipe the seat, and make the house smell nice. Ding dong, the doorbell. Who can it be? It's Darren and his wife. Mum pops downstairs, she's checked the rooms. Everything's spick and span. She passes Mary on the stairs, who's followed by a man. Daddy talks to Tanya. This buffet is simply cracking. Mum kisses her and down she goes to start a frisky lapping. Dad waves to Darren and he waves back. His mouth and hands are tied and something's dripping from his bum after Alistair went inside. His wife looks on, mouth full of wine and skin like mottled cloth but soon becomes distracted by sprays of creamy broth. Now, Alistair the barrister is a funny-looking man, a spiky nose and pointy chin and balls like chunks of ham. His wife is in the garden. Just look how hard she fucks. She's with that bloke called Trevor, who works for Scania, selling trucks. But who's that other fella? On the other side of Trevor. I'm not sure if I've met this bloke, but... My, oh my, he's making her choke. Now here comes Peter. He's a teacher, looking out for Mary. He always smells like chicken, and his back is very hairy. Mary's making quite a noise. She quivers with sensation. In pops Peter, smooth as silk, a double penetration. We all get tired, we all lie down, and have a little chat. Thanks for coming to our party. Oh no, thank you, giggles Pat. Funny noises, funny smells. The sheet's all damp and sticky. It's time to put our clothes on and head back to the kitchen. We take our keys and say goodbye with little winks of joy. Dad shouts to Carl at the end of the drive. You've left your favourite toy. He stumbles back. You wouldn't believe. It's chemistry, he lectures. I think he's got his compounds wrong. And suddenly... He wretches. We push him away and wave goodbye, saying, Thanks for all the fun. Lock the door. Turn off the lights. Dad's off to wash his bum. Off to bed. It's nice and clean. I tuck up with your daddy. Tomorrow's Granny's birthday. We'll get another party ready.